guys. Yeah, it's me. Obviously. I don't know why I say that every video I do, but it's me. Anyway, right, this is my entrance video to the Steve Mottram um, M group build. Running from August the 23rd, 2016 to January the 10th, 2017. So, any vehicle that has, or any plane, anything apparently, that has an M in it. So that leaves it wide open, doesn't it? But this is my entrance. I'm going to do the Hobby Boss Leopard 2A6M Canadian. Now, I'm a glutton for punishment, because I said after I, after I did the Buffalo that I wouldn't do another one. We started armour not for a long time. But I've had this in my stash for a long time now, so I thought, you know what? I'm just going to go for it. So this is what I'm doing. Now, this is a typical Hobby Boss kit. And it, I'll do them in a minute. It's, it's absolutely rammed. And you've got a colour call out there. Three-tone camo with the slatted armour as in sandy brain so that'll make uh, an interesting build more slatted armour <laughs> that's that instructions are normal instructions so it's just a bit, a bit more light yeah I've, it's a bit, a bit dark in here today guys because I've got the curtains drawn and I've got the fan on it's the only way I can actually stay in my cave because it's a bit hot I'm not going to complain too much because we don't get it very often in England. Anyway, back to this. I haven't even opened it yet. But it's it's all typical Hobby Boss. There's no flash. Very nice detail. There's the uh, gun and stuff. Which, to be fair, I might look for an aftermarket barrel, but there's the gun. There's absolutely no flash on it whatsoever. There's the poly caps. You know. It's the usual. I'm not going to do an inbox review because there's bound to be one, and people have bound to have built this before. So there's you, you know, plenty to do. There's a couple of, uh, a couple of three of uh, photo etch, a bit of string for the rope. I might look for some um, aftermarket tow cables, clear parts with decals with a Canadian maple leaf. Uh, I can't see the rest of them, but I haven't opened it yet, so. Um, some stowage to fold with my uh, chunky fingers. I think that may be a job for the wife. Uh, yep, yeah. suspension arms, wheels, turret, no turret. I just want to make that nice touch. The upper hull and it's your own little box to protect it. The lower hull, so detailed. Yeah. Horrible things. Rubber band tracks. Guess what, guys? Yep, yeah, I'm not using them. Uh, <laughs> I don't like them. Some people do. I mean, I've used them on a few things. I just don't like them. Oh, I don't know. But I've got some uh, aftermarket ones anyway, so I'm sure use them. I've had them in the stash for as long I think for as long as I've had this kit. So they bought for this kit, so I'll use them. Um, so yeah, that's uh, everything. Never get it back in. Yeah. That's uh, that's the kit that I'm building. Okay. Now this, I bought these at the same time. These are uh, AFV Club um, sticker simulating anti-reflection coating lenses for the for the um, Leopard. So I'll definitely be using them. I don't know if you get that on this, but they do tend to, they do kind of change colour, which is quite cool. Let's see if I can back in the box. 
bolts. Okay, so there's that part. Now we're gonna do we'll do the bit. I've got the other bit somewhere. And here I've got the uh, Bronco um, Leopard 2 workable tracks. Um, I bought these when I bought the kit. But, uh, I'm going to use them with the kit. So that guys is my uh, entrance video for the uh, Steve Mottram M group build. I will put a link. Let's do it with that arm so you can see me finger pointing downwards. I don't know why, but it's just pointing downwards <laughs> underneath the video. I'll uh, put the links on to the group build, Facebook page and whatever. If you fancy having a look, come along, join them all the merrier. It's going to be a good laugh. So there's a fair few people involved in it. So, yeah, so there you go. That's it. That's my uh, video for the uh, build. All right, guys, catch you soon. Bye.